Uh, hopefully we've actually got John Cofino on the line. Are you there, John? Hello? Hi, John. How's it going? I can, I can only hear you. Uh, how are we doing? Okay. Uh, thanks for coming on the show via, via phone. That, that's my pleasure. Uh, first of all, we'll get, we'll get straight down to it and talk about your season. Uh, you're on a, a nice little run, but the last few results haven't gone your way. I'm sorry, it's, it's hard to hear you. Uh, the, you were on a good run, but now the results are starting, have, have gone a bit awry. Yeah, yeah, a couple of games, you know, we, uh, we're, we're going back and forth, winning and losing a couple of games, just a couple. Uh, you know, uh, after the Christmas break, we haven't been our, we haven't been ourselves, you know. Um, hmm. um, we're just, uh, we're, we're just trying to find ourselves. Uh, why do you think that is? Excuse me. Why do you think that is? Well, that's a good question. You know, we were we were we were we were, we were riding high, mm. and um, we um, had a nice break. You know, we got we were off for like ten days and came back and just uh, it kind of kind of like stunted us a little bit, stunted our growth a little bit. But we're we're. Uh, we're regrouping. The guys know that we what, what, what got us here what, was was you know teamwork and defense and you know I don't know it's uh, it, it was a nice little run and we're, we're going to try to take it one game at a time and, and get back to that and, and try to sustain our, our place in, in, in the ladder. Uh, what's your aim for the rest of the season? Do you think that you, you can get to the top of the ladder and maybe maybe a playoff push? Well, yeah, we, we'd like to, we, you know, we, we'd like to um, stay in the top four, you know, and Newcastle's running away with things, and um, but we'd like to stay, you know, we, we, we can only control what we can control, and what we'd like to do is, you know, we, we, we'd like to just to stay within a good position for the playoffs. It sounds like you mean to stay focused now, John. Is that basically what you're going to be focusing on, uh, pushing yeah, everybody? Yeah, you know, it's a long season. You know, guys hit the wall every now and then. You got to, you got to get on them for yeah. for for, uh, for certain, <laughs> um, you know, certain things, and it's it's a it's a long haul. Mm. It's obviously your first season with in the BBL. Uh, yeah. How have we found it? You know, it's it's a lot better. It's a lot better than I thought. You know, it's a lot better than I thought. It's very competitive. I think from top to bottom, the teams are just incredibly. Um, you know, they they can, they can beat you if if you don't if if you don't bring your best. The last the team the 13th place team can beat anybody. Mm. You know, so it, it, it's 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 from what I'm told, this has been the strongest it's been in a long time. Uh, you've had a few uh, a, a player turnover. Uh, quite yeah. a lot of player turnover. Uh, how 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 impressive is, it, impressive is it that you managed to go on a ten game winning streak with with that player turnover? Yeah, you know it's never easy. It's never easy to make changes. It's never easy to um, you know because when, when you bring in new players, you have to teach them the system. They got to get used to you. They got to get used to their teammates. <laughs> they got to get used to um, you know the the league, the the the, the, the referees. It, it, you know, so you really take time kind of like taking a, a minor step back, you know, but... Uh, yeah. There have obviously been a few controversial uh, player departures with uh, Julius Hodge and Devan Bailey. Is there anything you'd like to say about that or, or not? I'm sorry, can you say that again? You've obviously had a, f uh, a few acrimonious departures with Julius Hodge and Devan Bailey. Is there anything you'd like to say about that? Um, you know, it, it wasn't a basketball thing, uh, so I really, I'm not at, at liberty to, to, to really give you, my, you know, a, a, a sound answer. You know, that, that, that was between the team and, and, and the player as far as contractually speaking. So, you know, if it was a basketball thing and they, and they, they did something basketball-wise, then I could comment and tell you that, you know, hey, this, this, it didn't work out basketball-wise. But you know what? It, it, was, it was contractually, and, 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 the, and the club had a... Had to, had to do things the way they felt was, was, was best for the team. Um, but anything basketball-wise, I'd, I'd be more than happy to comment. You know, I was happy with Julius's play. I liked Devin as our backup point guard. 
Um, but you know, there there are things that you have to, you know, you have to abide by. And, and I, I guess if, it, if the, the agreement is broken, then you know the the, the team and the, and the player have to part ways, which I don't like doing. You know, I, I never like doing. I, I like to have a consistent and 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 you know have the continuity going. But uh, that's the you know that's basketball. That's sports. Uh I don't know if you saw this, but uh, Basketball England, England are looking into maybe reviewing the BBL. And I just wondered how successful you think the BBL is as a league. Yeah, you know, I, I, I just briefly saw, about, saw it and heard, heard about it. Um, personally, you know, <laughs> I leave that up to, uh, I leave that up to, 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 the, to the chairman and how they want to deal with it. But... Um, I, I feel, you know, um, a, 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 any support that England basketball gives is, is great, and I think I think basketball is growing in this country. I think it's 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 proof that that England basketball wants to get more involved, and um, uh, you know, we all know that football is the number one sport here, and there's no there's no denying that. And, but basketball is a growing sport, and 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 the, the success of the BBL is is a big part of it, and I think we need to do more. Uh, grassroots stuff with the younger uh, kids and athletes, and um, so uh, I, 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 I don't know. I, I'd have to look more into what what, they, what their plans are. You know. Uh, in terms of Cheshire, do you see it as maybe a long-term thing for you? Is this somewhere where you want to grow a team? Well, I don't want to go anywhere. Um, <laughs> I told them that I'm on a two-year deal, uh, but you know. I don't. I don't like to talk about the future. I, I, my job is uh, is is here now to bring to bring some silverware in and win games and and, and go as far as we can go. And you know, I, I never really uh, look look ahead. I, I, I every job I take, I, I I hope it's my last one and 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 I last forever. I mean, I told them I could I can live on I can live on pizza the rest of my life. So it doesn't matter. <laughs> Where I where I coach, uh, I want to I want to stay somewhere and settle in, settle down. Okay, well, uh, thank you for speaking to us this evening, John. Thank you.